This video is sponsored by BMI Solutions, your one-stop shop for document scanners in the UK. Check out bmisolutions.co.uk. Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is the G-Raid with Thunderbolt from G Technology by Hitachi. And it's a good, good thing to see some Thunderbolt devices finally becoming available. This particular one's a four terabyte model. I just wanted you to see the product packaging before I show you the device. And it's really nicely presented, the packaging. We've got some details on the contents on the side, a three year limited warranty on this one as well. And then some details on the back about the performance we could expect to actually see. Now, USB 2 offers up to 480 megabits per second, FireWire 800 up to 800 megabits per second, and Thunderbolt, a theoretical 10 gigabits per second. That is absolutely amazing. So let's get the product packaging out of the way, and we'll have a closer look at the drive itself. So this is the G-Raid. It comes in various capacities. This particular one is a four terabyte unit. So it's got two two terabyte drives in here. Really nicely presented. We've got this sort of uh, design reminiscent of the Mac Pro and a metal casing, very well made and very solid. Activity light down the bottom here and it weighs an absolute ton because of those hard drives inside. Side on profile for you, again, looks very, very nice indeed. And then round the back, this is where all the connections happen. I'll give you a closer look at this. We have got a little tiny fan in the back here. We have got a power button, input there for the power supply, Kensington lock so we can tether it to a desk. And then we've got dual Thunderbolt ports so we can connect one to our computer and then the other one can daisy chain another device. Now also in the product packaging or in the box, you do get some warranty information. You also get a quick setup guide. Now these are really easy to set up anyway, but it just guides you through how to connect it and put the power supply in, etc. and about the daisy chaining. And then you also get a country specific cable. This is a three pin UK plug on this one, obviously, because I'm in the UK. And it's a figure eight adapter on this end. And that goes into a tiny little power brick, which looks like this, it's a multi-voltage power brick and then this end goes into the drive itself. So now what I'm gonna do is connect the G-Raid up to my MacBook Air via Thunderbolt and show you how it performs. So here we go, we've got everything connected. We've got the Thunderbolt cable coming out the side here into the G-Raid drive, and we've got Blackmagic Design's disk speed test software running. This is a free app in the Mac App Store, and it's used for testing the read and write speeds of hard drives and solid state drives, etc. So the first thing we're gonna do is click the little cogwheel in the middle here and select target drive. And this just ensures we've got the right drive selected. So we're gonna go down here and select G-Raid with Thunderbolt and click choose. And then we're gonna click start. And we're gonna let this run through a couple of times. Now, first of all, we can see, wow, the write speed there, 294.7 megabytes per second and the read 298.4 megabytes per second. Let's give you a little close up of that. You can see this running through for a second time or third time now, 290.4 megabytes per second right and 300.5 megabytes per second on the read speed. That is absolutely phenomenal. Very, very good performer. So this is the G-Raid from G Technology, part of the Hitachi Group. This is a superb performer. Obviously you can set it up in different RAID configurations, but for performance, almost 300 megabytes per second on write and read speeds. That is absolutely fantastic. Superb for doing video work. You do have to pay a premium price for these products at the moment, but this G-RAID from G Technology absolutely performs really solidly and is a great little unit. Looks superb as well, solid build and solid performance. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Dave from Geekanoids. Please do hit that like button and I will see you all in the next video.